Much of your happiness or unhappiness is determined by your personality, not by your circumstances. Martha Washington A ten-year-old boy decided to learn judo even though he lost his left arm in a car accident. He studied judo with a Japanese master. Because he believed that he had studied very diligently and made progress, he wondered why after three months of training, the teacher only taught him one martial arts style. Finally, unable to be patient anymore, the boy asked his teacher, Teacher, can't I learn other martial arts? He replied, This is the only martial art I taught you, and it is also the only martial art you need to learn. Although he did not understand all the teacher's words, trusting him, the boy continued to practice. Months later, his master took him to a judo competition. The boy was surprised to see that he easily won the first two matches. The third match was more difficult, but after a while, the opponent lost patience in his attacks. The boy cleverly used martial arts and won. Still surprised by his success, he confidently entered the final. This time, his opponent is a taller, stronger, and more experienced martial artist. Not long into the battle, the boy was repeatedly hit and completely overwhelmed. At the end of the first half, Fearing that the boy would be injured, the referee signaled to end the match early but his teacher did not agree, just let the boy continue. The master requested. Immediately after the match restarted, the opponent made a serious mistake. He underestimated his opponent and let his guard down. Immediately, the boy used his only martial arts to knock the opponent down and lock him on the floor. The boy won the championship. On the way home, the two teachers and students reviewed the fighting positions in each match. Only then did the boy muster up the courage to say the thing that had been haunting his mind for so long. Teacher, how can I become a champion with just one martial art like that? You win for two reasons. The teacher replied. The first reason is that you have almost mastered one of the most dangerous and effective moves in this martial art. The second reason is that the only way your opponent can break that stance is if they hold your left arm tightly and you don't have a left hand. Sometimes, someone's weakness becomes their greatest strength. Having advantages is a good thing, but being able to turn shortcomings into advantages is even more miraculous. Believe in yourself, you can do it all. Turn adversity into opportunities to help you achieve better things, will jolly.